What's going on guys, it's Gekamods here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install a cape to Minecraft. Whoa, yeah. So first of all, you need is 7-zip or Wimra, but I'm sure you already got that. If you don't, just head to the description and it'll be in there, and so you just go and download it and come straight back to this video. So once you've already got that, what you want to do, you want to head over to Minecraft, so let's go start my open up Minecraft. This is for version 1.6.2 and also for 1.6, because this is when this menu comes out here. So when you get this menu up, you want to click on your new profile. Then you want to name it whatever you want to call it. So as you can see in the top right, I've already got one called Gecko Capes. So let's call it Gecko Mods MC for Minecraft Capes. And then you want to just click Save Profile. And as you can see, at the second one down is Gecko Mods MC, which we just created. Then you just want to write in your username and password to log in. And just click Play. And just wait for it to load up. Then you can just close right out of them. So that's step one already done. Now what you want to do, you want to come over to your start button and write in percentage app data percentage sign and get onto your data roaming uh, file page. Then you want to click on dot Minecraft. Then you want to go to versions. Then as you can see here, you've got loads of them. Uh, you probably won't have as many as I do, but all you want to do, you want to click copy one. So basically you should have the 1.6.2 standard anyway, so basically you want to do copy it and then paste it. As you can see now I've got 1.2.6 copy, you want to rename it and just change the copy bit to whatever you want. So I'm just going to put cape as already got MC down. So what you might want to do as well, once you do that, you might want to copy that, what you just what you changed it to. As Now when you open up this folder, you got two. You've got a dot jar and a dot json. You want to rename both of them to what you name that folder. So basically, I'd name it to 1.6.2 cape. So as you see there, I've just changed them both. Then you want to open up the dot json folder, and you want to change the ID here to 1.6.2 cape, which I just did, and you want to save it. You can open it up with Notepad Plus Plus. It's probably a lot easier as you can just right click it and click Edit with Notepad Plus Plus, or you can just do it with regular old Notepad anyway. So after you do that, you want to go ahead to the internet, and you want to head to the description, and this this link for this website will be in there, I'll make sure it'll be in there. Once you come to this link, you'll come to this page, and what you want to do, you want to click on download now. Then you've got standard MC capes or extra. Basically the extra one is the same standard, so anyone who's got the mod can see your cape, and you can see your own obviously. Uh, but the extra bit just does, it says you can use animated and transparent capes and I thought it's just going to be exactly the same, the exact same as the standard but you can do that extra little bit and I thought what the heck, I might, might as well just install the extra bit. So basically go ahead and choose what one you want, you've got Forge, Standard, MC, Capes, whatever one you want, I'm just going to do this one. And click it, it'll come onto the adf.ly, it's just a shortcut, shortcut link, sort of page to shorten down the links. Then just wait for it to five seconds at the top and click to skip add and it starts downloading. Once you've got downloaded, just open it up with WinRAR and you get these two folders. Then you want to head back to that to the data roaming dot Minecraft and to the folder that you renamed and created to where you got the dot JSON and dot jars. Then you want to go to the dot jar, right click it, open with, and open it with WinRAR. What you want to do, you'll see a meta inf. You want to delete that. Just click delete and just wait for it deleted then go to the other WinRAR file which you got the two files you just downloaded and just drag them into the f your WinRAR dot j dot jar sorry not json 1.2 sorry if I, ain't lo if I lost you so basically you got on the right we've got the file we just downloaded and on the left we've got a minecraft file file folder sorry so all we're doing is dragging that into the dot minecraft folder sort of thing and that's it once you've done that you can close out of these and out of this one and if you head back to the website as you can see I'm sort of logged in but wait I'll show you so when you come to it it will come up like this in the top and corner where my mouse is I'll highlight it what you'll do is ask you for your minecraft username just write in xne which is my one just write in your one and click next here it will say it appears it's your first time but I've already logged in here what you want writing a password? I wouldn't recommend writing your password what you actually use for um, Minecraft. Just writing a random password. So I've already got one, so I'll just write mine in and click login. Once you log in, it'll come up with my capes, um, cape gallery, my animated cape, animated cape gallery. So um, 
what you want to do you pick whatever one you want to I'm just going to click on the cape gallery oh, cape gallery and you've got all these different capes designs you can make your own and upload them or you can use one of these I'm just going to use this white and green creeper one that's already got the minecon one on so what you want to do just click on use this cape and it's done it says you can stop using the cape by either going to your cape gallery so not this one if you go to dun 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 sorry I'm trying to find where it is at the bottom you go to my capes and it just comes up with this I've this is what cape I'm using cape enabled ticks everything so now if I go to my minecraft so let's load up minecraft click on run and just wait for the launcher to start up and got at the top you see on the profile I've got Gecko Mods MC and just click play and we start up a single player when it's all loaded up single player new world as you can see on my back I've got the mic I've got this creeper face which I've clicked on as my cape so yeah guys it's pretty straightforward it's really simple quick to do hope you like it hope it works if you have any problems make sure you leave a comment down below and I'll try to help you straight away as much as I can uh, and I'll point you in the right direction if I can't so yeah guys thanks for watching please comment and subscribe and yeah guys thanks for watching